Senate Republicans today revealed their plan to cut taxes. They did. Governor Reynolds unveiled her proposal earlier this month, but as KCCI's Amanda Rooker shows us, Senate Republicans want to make even bigger changes. That's right, Steve and Stacy. Governor Reynolds proposed a 4% flat income tax rate by 2026. Well, Senate Republicans want to take that even further. They're proposing a 3.6% flat income tax rate. That's by 2028. They also want to make some big changes to Iowa's corporate tax code. Their bill would get rid of more than $140 million in tax exemptions and credits. It would also drive down the corporate tax rate to 7.8%. Their proposal calls for turning the Taxpayer Relief Fund into the Income Tax Elimination Fund. That would be used for future personal income tax cuts, which would move Iowa towards eliminating the income tax entirely. These are real significant permanent tax cuts that's going to affect every single Iowan to the tune of about $1,600 per family. And so um, that, that's what we want to do is keep the promise to make permanent, sustainable, historic tax cuts for Iowans. A Senate Republicans plan still keeps the governor's proposal to eliminate state taxes on retirement income. Senate Democratic leader Zach Walls responded in a statement calling the plan, quote, another tax giveaway to millionaires and big corporations that would result in higher taxes for hardworking Iowans and the defunding of public education, public safety and health care services. He says Senate Democrats are focused on, quote, targeted tax cuts for middle class families, expanding access to affordable child care and paid family leave, fully funding our schools and making job training and apprenticeships available and affordable for all Iowans.